Senator, I've heard that recently there's been some talk on Beacon Hill about raising the personal income tax to address the state's budget deficit. Given the state of the economy and the fact that we've already had some tax increases, do you think this is a wise move? Well, every economist will tell you that when you're in a recession, the last thing you, you should do is to raise taxes because it ha is the equivalent of throwing ice water on the economy. And Lord knows our economy is already uh, cold. It's certainly not, it hasn't heated up yet as far as the recovery goes. And I think you have to put this in perspective. I mean, we just increased taxes by a billion dollars last year. Mm -hmm. um, the business community has been hit the last four out of five years with uh, with um, with tax increases. And you know, wherever you look, it's tax, 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 tax. You know, the sales tax was just increased. The meals tax was increased. The it was a, a alcohol tax that was implemented. A meals tax. A, a, a um, satellite dish tax for people uh, who have those. I mean, uh, and those, that doesn't include all the fees that have just gone up on people, particularly anybody using the registry uh, will notice that. Um, and now uh, everybody's sort of lurking around the building and people are coming in and they're saying, you know what, we need an income tax hike. It's the only way we're going to get out of this crisis. And the fact of the matter is, is, you know, um, the income tax should be the last thing that we do. Um, and people need to recognize that the way you get money in the treasury of the state so you can spend it on all these good things is to make sure that the business community um, and that the economy of the state is humming along and if that take you know, if that's going well um, the revenue situation takes care of itself and we're in a state right now that um, ha has some big problems as far as creating new jobs we our uh, rank pretty much last or uh, next to last in the country as far as new job creation in Massachusetts. Uh, companies don't want to do business here because they feel as though it's uh, too expensive, that the uh, tax code is too unpredictable. Maybe, you know, the, they, they do something thinking that the tax rate's a certain rate and then the state changes it and, you know, it's very hard for those companies to plan ahead. Mm -hmm. So we need a better business climate here and we need some people at the state house who understand that, again, it's you know, it's not the government's money, it's the people's money, and when you can't go pick in their pocket um, when you're overspending and, and, you know, and not doing, uh, not uh, having good management um, of your own finances. And um, if we don't get the business community uh, to become more competitive here in Massachusetts, um, we're not going to see, we're going to be on this downward spiral for a long time. I like the idea of trimming government waste before we raise the personal income tax. Absolutely. Thank you.